The average American thinks he's above average. <laughs> this is the inside of my brain. I'm in a coma. How do you wake up from a coma? That was not rhetorical. Let's use our brains here, all right? There's about 100 of us, so that's what? 75 brains? <laughs> we gotta think, we gotta think hard. How do you think hard? I know, we could snort some Viagra. That would make us think hard, wouldn't it? Huh? <laughs> These poster boys for the Republican Party, by their own definition, are drug dealers and sex offenders. What does that tell us? That tells us that these Republicans are really Democrats. <laughs> Good, we've pissed off both sides of the political fence. We can solve partisan politics, it's simple. All we have to do is eliminate the two-party system. No more Republicans, no more Democrats. We combine the truth that's left of both parties into one new super after-hours party. <laughs> We call ourselves the Republicans. <laughs> Unless we can't agree on that, then we call ourselves the Demolicans. <laughs> we use compromise to solve all of our problems. Let's start with a safe, non-inflammatory issue first. Stem cell research. <laughs> Democrats are for, Republicans are against. A Republican Demolican uses compromise. We say yes to stem cell research, but only with Democratic embryos. <laughs> <laughs> What about prayer in school? This is when the Republicans are for, the Democrats are against. A Republican Demolican uses compromise. We say no to prayer in school, except on exam day when it does some good. <laughs> and no complaining from the Republicans on this decision. You pray too much as it is anyway. Besides, remember, you get to kill Democratic embryos. <laughs> so basically, your prayers have been answered. <laughs> there are four levels of truth. Yes, there's the illusion of truth, the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. <laughs> but be careful. Remember, opening the door of truth can cause serious side effects. Okay, no problem. <laughs> the truth hurts, doesn't it? <laughs>